speaking <laughs> about women, where should I locate a person who is now mega popular, at least in Europe, Sabine Hossenfelder? Sabine is in Germany and Frankfurt. I know, but is she purely, uh, really also a scientist or more a popularizer? No, no, she, now Sabina has a different history. Sabina is an elementary particle theorist who works on the phenomenology. And when we say phenomenology, we don't mean what you mean by it. We mean studies of the collisions of elementary particles sufficient to predict the results of the collisions and so forth. So they stand between the theoretical physicist in particle physics and the, and the observer. Now, Sabina was always very correct. She always found errors in other people's work and criticized them. And this is the only way I can interpret it. After many years of postdocs, also some preference established because of her family situation as wanting not to live across Europe from her, from her family. She ended up without a job. So she invented this job of auto-popularizer, <laughs> which I think she does so well. But she didn't, nobody appointed it to her. And it's a shame, I, the way I understand it, it is something that she can do to both to, to carry on her work, which she does very successfully. There's, there's a number of other things, the number of my favorite ideas that were wrong, and she showed why they were wrong. And we wrote several good papers together as well. But I think she deserves much more as a professional physicist. But what she's making a living, a good living with, is this professional popularization. And she is tough. She doesn't let, and she doesn't give any prisoners in debate or discussion. I noticed this as you put it precisely that she doesn't take prisoners. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 